Hey everyone, it's Tuesday again. Are we ready for some phonics fun today? Fabulous. Right, let's see. Can you go through it and remind me of all these sounds? Remember, only say the pure sounds. Right, I'm not going to say them today. I want you guys to say them really loud, okay? You ready? One, two, three, go! Fantastic, everybody. That was really good. I'm really impressed that you remembered all of those. Oh, what's he saying today? I can't remember his alternate group phone names. Can you help me? Shall we have a see if we can yeah. see if we can help him? You ready? He says, I know that the O and the A L graphemes can make a different phoneme, but I'm not sure which phoneme it is in these words. So remember, the O can sound like an O, but it, the O can sound like a U. Remember, Ow can sound like Ow, or Ow can sometimes sound like O. Alright, so in this word, it has the O. Now, is it the O or the U? Let's try it with U and let's see. You ready? P U U. P U U. No. Let's try it with the O. You ready? P. Ooh, pull. Yeah, I think it might be that one. Well done. Now, which one is this? Should we try it with up? Mm, uh, sick. Music. Mm, don't think that's quite right either. Let's try it with you. You ready? Mm, you, sick. Music. Yeah, perfect. Right then, let's look at this one. Now it has this graphy. So is it out? Or does it sound like O? What do you think? Let's try it with Ow first. You ready? N Ow. Snow. No. Let's try it with O. Sno. Snow. Yeah, like the stuff we get in winter. Fantastic. Now, there's one left, so let's try this one with Ow. You ready? K Ow. Cow. Moo. Wow says Kathy, wow. Remember, so now Rex is saying, now let's learn some new alternate graphemes. Kathy says, remember that means they sound the same as Rex sounds, but they look different, okay? So, this this is the Rex. Kathy has two s. She has an S and a T, and an S and an E. Now we learn that the S and the E can sometimes sound like a Z as well. So it can sound like a z and it can sound like a s. Fantastic. And another rec sound is the u. Now sometimes the u can do like this. But Kathy's u is this one. The u can sometimes sound like an u. And the split diagraph can sometimes sound like an u. All right then. Ooh, which one is here? Can you remember? Yeah, it's the s. Well done. Hmm, what did we say this one could sound like? And oh, well done. What about this one? Yeah, it's this. Uh, oh, split diagraph. It can sometimes sound like an. Oh, fantastic. You are really trying hard, Rex says. Kathy says, wow, Rex said you were good at reading, but this is amazing. Now, you have some words on your tables. Let's see if we can. Have a go at matching. So, first of all, we've got to match these two rec sounds to their Kathy sounds. So, which two sounded like the oh? You remember? Yeah? 
It's this one and this one. Fantastic. So that means the other two must sound like the s. Well done. So this, the s and the t is a s, and the s and the e is a s. Right. Okay, you're going to have a go now at matching these to all their pictures. Okay. So let's blend it. You ready? U, I, S, N. Listen. Listen. <gasps> That's what we have to do, isn't it? We have to listen. Well done. And this one. Remember, it has this at the end. Sometimes they sound like a Z. But what is it being today? It's being a S. Okay, you ready? House. House. <gasps> Fantastic. House, everybody. Well done. Now uh, this one. Oh, look, it has split digraph. What did we say the split digraph sounds like? Oh, oh, you ready? D, uh, mm. Done. Yeah, done. When you've done everything off your list. Fantastic. Right, you ready? We're going to look at this one. Now, I know something about this off. Oh, what is this off oh, pretending to be today? Oh, it's a oh. You ready? Ooh. Ooh, e. This U is being an E. Worry, worry, worry. Yeah, when you're worried about something, fantastic. Oh, same with this one. It's got a split digraph. S uh, mm, some. Yeah, look, there are some apples in the tree. Oh, this one. Remember, it's got the S at the end. M mouse. Mouse! Fantastic reading, everybody. Oh, now this one is a long word, isn't it? And it's got this. What's this one being? Oh, it's being a s. Are we ready? And I'm going to tell you that this ch is being a k as well, like that, like we've learnt before. Are you ready? K r i s m a s. Christmas! <gasps> Christmas! I love Christmas. Oh, this one here, are we ready? Horse. 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 Oh, you're so good at this blending. Oh, are you ready? So. K -a -m. Come. Yeah? Come. Fantastic. And this one here. B. The remember this art is pretending to be a uh. brother, brother, brother. Well done. And this one here. Now I'm going to tell you that this one, this here, the l and the f, that is another Kathy sound, and it just says l. Okay, so l. So let's read it now. You ready? K a s u castle. Oh, can you see the castle? There it is. Fantastic. I have no idea why this picture of the calendar has popped up. Let's take it away. Anyway, right. What well, fabulous reading. I think we should look at them more now. Yeah. Can we remember? Let's say them really quickly. So in this that has the s and the t, we have listen. Castle, Christmas. In this one with the S and the E, we have house, mouse, horse. Oh, look, there's the calendar. Oh, the word must have been missing. Silly me. Now, this is the R, which is sounding like a. Oh, well done. So we have worry, worry. We have brother. And we didn't blend this one because it was off the screen. Silly me. So, m a m th, month, yeah, like January, February, March, and April, all the different months of the year, month. Oh, and we have this one, which is also sounding like an uh, you ready? Done, when you've done everything, some, and come. Fantastic. See you tomorrow. Well done, everybody.